Today I want to do a really quick review of the Heil PR40 and the Rode Procaster microphones. Now these are great microphones for um, podcasters if you're recording a narration over a series of photos or a video that you're producing, if you um, are on web chats a lot and you want to have a very professional voice there. Uh, whatever kind of media you're you're using, if any kind of narration where the mic can be in the shot, uh, these are great microphones to use. The thing that I like about these microphones is they isolate sound really, really well. You can get mics that sound very nice, like a, a AT2020 is a really, really nice mic, a USB mic that's convenient for doing things, but it just doesn't isolate sounds well. And so if the kids are playing in the ro other room, a fan's on anything, you hear it. And these microphones do much, much, much better at isolating the sound of the voice of just being very, very directional. Uh, so you have to be close up to the microphone. If you're far away from the microphone, it just does not sound as good. Um, so let's do a head-to-head -head comparison. I'm using the exact same pop filter, the exact same stand, the exact same high-quality mic cable, and Oh, and both of them are going into the Zoom H6. The gain is set the exact same. You have been listening to me on the Rode Procaster. Uh, so this is what my voice sounds like on the Rode Procaster. And this is what my voice sounds like on the Heil PR40. Listening to the sound, I mean, they sound so, so, so similar. Uh, I mean, there's very, very little difference between the sound on these two microphones. If I'm really picky and I go into a dark room and I do some meditation and I listen to both of them, the Heil does have just a little bit less clarity in the voice. It sounds... There's just a little bit more muffle to the sound. Very, very, very slight but I do notice it just barely again. The reason that I care about that, and again, it's not that big of a deal, but the reason that I care about it is I listen to podcasts on one and a half or two times speed, and that's where I'm using these microphones. I produce the Improve Photography Podcast, and I listen to podcasts on one and a half or two times speed, and so if a podcast doesn't have perfect clarity in the voice, it's you can't listen to it as fast, and I just don't listen at one time speed. The audio quality has to be really, really good, or I just won't subscribe to a pro to a podcast. There are too many out there to choose from. So I did notice that from the Heil, but it is just very, very, very slight. Uh, but I will say that the Heil does have a slightly more full voice. It's not quite as thin as the Procaster, um, which is a nice thing, but I, if I were to compare the audio quality, I would probably give a little edge to the Rode Procaster, even though they're so, so similar. But the big difference is price. The Rode Procaster costs more than a hundred bucks cheaper than the Heil, at least at the prices that I saw, and so I'm not sure why you would choose the Heil unless you're hearing hearing something that I don't. I just think the Rode Procaster is a better deal. I like the feel of the Rode Procaster. I mean, it's just big and thick and cold steel. Uh, the Heil's also very nice build quality. I mean, it's a beautiful microphone. I just happen to prefer the look of the Rode a little bit more and the feel of it. Uh, they're both really nice microphones. You can't go wrong with either. Definitely don't switch uh, because of this review, but if you're buying your first, I, I would probably pick the Rode Procaster over the very well-regarded Heil PR40. That's my review. If you are buying these, uh, one of these microphones, really would help me out if you'd go through my affiliate link to Amazon. It doesn't cost you any more, and I get a small commission from doing it. Uh, my affiliate link is, if you buy the Heil, is improvephotography.com slash Heil, H-E-I-L. And for the Rode Procaster, it's improvephotography.com slash Procaster. So if you just hit that link, it's going to immediately redirect you over to Amazon. You'll pay the same low price that Amazon always has, and I get a small commission. So if you are buying it, I'd appreciate that. Have a good day, and I hope this review has been helpful.